sniper. So go this way. Flex. I like it. Now, yeah, dude, that game is totally different compared to like any other game. Like, it's it's so crazy how like tactical you have to be. See, the reason why I like Ash a lot is because like she's the only character that like likes to attack and like go in and like get kills, right? But even then, like you can't even really do that that much. Um, because like you know, it's like you get one little shot to the leg and you're like, dead because the shots are like instant death. Hey, that's good, Dylan. Congrats, dude. The end of the CSGO. Oof, man. It is... I like. I enjoy it, but, like, it is just, like, not my style of, like, of how, how to play. I hate sitting still for so long. It, it's just... It's really difficult for me. That's why I kind of like Fortnite a lot, because it's all about just kind of whoever normally pushes first gets the win. Yeah, the arm, yeah, she has really low armor. She like, she's she's so freaking fast. Oh goodness. Um, I don't know if I'll get that, Dylan. I really don't. I I highly doubt it, to be honest. I don't know. Call. I got. I played a little bit of the last Call of Duty. And it just sucked. I, 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 I don't know. Call of Duties are really just watered down for me now. And like, just like the skill gap. Yeah, I, I don't know how it'll be. We'll see. They're just, they're trying to just stay relevant. They're trying to like stay, uh, stay with the trends and stuff. And, you know, Siege has been seeing a lot of success and everything, but I don't, I don't see it doing well. I don't know. I think Call of Duty will be like, I think they'll eventually probably make their last one eventually. At least within, I don't know, but we'll see. I don't want a game to die, but that game's just freaking dead. <laughs> I'm sure, the, I'm sure they'll figure it out. I'm sure they got something planned. They're they're a pretty big company, so Hey, um Ahmed, how, how long have you been playing uh oh god. Uh, how long have you been playing what's it called for? Uh Rainbow Six.
like, I got so lucky there. He outplayed me so hard, but he just missed a shot. Really sucks getting a build battle with two people. Um, dude, I still have a lot of learning too. So, okay, I've, I'll be honest with you, I, get, I probably get frustrated really easily. And uh, whenever I stream, I try to mask it as much as possible. And I, I do get off sometimes and stop streaming because of it. But that's best one number one thing. I don't know if you know him, um, who he is, but there's a guy named Crafty. Uh, he streams a lot. He does solo squads. That's how I learned to build. I learned how to build and everything from him. Um, and he is like... I don't know, he just like he does solo squads and stuff and he just that's how I learned I just learned that way building is the number one thing I can recommend for you is learn how to build once you learn how to build um, you legit you're unstoppable for the most part your aim doesn't matter or anything you can just literally just take on any fight for the most part after that once you get the building down it's just learning about what to do in specific situations which is what I'm working on right now because I, I got the building down for the most part, right? Like, I mean, you know, I can kind of do it, but um, it's just, I make I make silly mistakes. I, I, that's the best thing I can recommend to you is just whenever you make a mistake or how you die, rather than say, oh, that's so BS because shotgun, right? Or, oh, wow, the bloom messed me up. Just uh, realize it that it's on you, that there's something that you should have done to make the situation better. Like, there, right? I probably should have kept building up instead of... Uh, taking the challenge it, but I took the gamble and got very lucky there like you know it's just a, it's a unnecessary risk that I took and that's some, that's something I do a lot I, I rely a lot on my shot so that, that's the thing I'd recommend I just kind of like watch a lot of streamers and stuff That I don't want to say you just lose, but I don't know. Like it's just it's just kind of like you know when people do the double staircase, right? Um, you just kind of uh, you have to like. Yeah, like whenever someone has height advantage on you, you either, one, you just lose the fight, like I said, or you play, you play to like knock down his stuff and force him to come down if he's super high. It depends on the height now, but uh, yeah, like it really just kind of depends how high y'all are, or you just turtle the whole time and hope you can, um, hope you can uh, come back and just win that way. You don't, you don't try to push up on him, I don't think. I think that's honestly the better play. You kind of just see if, see how patient they can be. And uh, if they're not patient enough, you just kind of wait and just see what you can force them to come down. I think that's probably the better play. I think I'm going to shoot rockets at these guys. I don't know. Is that a range?
All right, sweet dude. I appreciate it. Okay, so there's someone up on the hill up there. Grenade launcher is pretty nice. Okay. <laughs> see there's probably yeah i think there's someone in there i may get rid of the grenade launcher to be honest but i'm not sure yet it's so nice though i haven't really had a reason for a sniper is that guy just sitting in a bush i think he is where'd he go oh no he's right there Sweet. I I actually really struggle with explaining things. I'm glad. Oh, that's right here. One more guy, and there he is. He's right ahead of us. I think this is where I use the grenade launcher. Reload with my shotgun. He's in there. Seventeen kills, dude. That's actually one of my highest. GG's that guy. He played. He played well. He just gave up high ground out there. He had me beat the whole time, but he, got, he tried to he tried to drop down.